Um, sir, when did you start painting nudes? Uh, I started paint, painting nudes, I guess, when I was about grade 5 or grade 6. But I was just using my imagination. I always knew how to draw. I started painting, really painting, after I went to Europe, and that was uh, about 1965. And I went to, a, uh, to Germany to a uh, district called Schwabing. Schwabing in Germany, in Munich, was a place where all the art galleries are, the artists in the street, they were there, and, uh, and also the theaters. The theaters were there, and the opera house. So I was continuously exposed for about more than four years in, a, in, a, in, in, art, in art, in sculpture, in the, in the uh, opera, and theaters, that, that is my exposure to art. I was just painting things, but uh, most of the time I was uh, in nudes. I was painting my friends uh, and uh, mostly women. And, uh, and then uh, some men that I would sort of copy statues of uh, well-known uh, well, well known statues. I started taking color separation in Kiel, that's also a part of the middle of Germany. And later on, uh, for that was for color separation. Then I traveled, uh, I studied in, in uh, Belgium for photography, not for the paper. And, and I was exposed also to mostly photography at the time until I went to Holland, back to color separation and printing. Now, uh, when I returned over here, after a few, a few years, I married Silvana. She started putting up a gallery over here because she was selling the works of my sister, Isabel, and she met all these uh, artists which is uh, the Saturday, original Saturday group and she became very close to them while I was working selling printing supplies printing supplies and uh, films and, uh, and paper from then uh, from the, the time Silvana became active with the Saturday group uh, I was joining them every Saturday in Casa de Oro, and I would just sketch, not as a, not as a artist uh, that is uh, professional, but uh, I could, I could draw, I could draw, and uh, only after that did I started selling my words. Uh, I started painting different forms like horses and fish and and uh, uh, figures of nudes and things like this. But uh, that's when I started painting. So when, when I was uh, always with the artists and things like this, I had to go to New York. And uh, most of the time, every six months, I would spend one month in New York for several years. And then I went also to now, in New York, I went to a, a, a school where they had professional models where you are free to paint them as you are. And then I, I was beside many of these artists who are very uh, accepted already in New York. So I, I would learn from them style, but some, suddenly when uh, you don't have a formal schooling of uh, fine arts. You know, you, you, you trend to have your own taste. I mean, as uh, I know, uh, painting of uh, women form 
I was first attracted to the nude statue in France in the museum of uh, the, the statue of we, uh, Willem Dorf and uh, that it's called the, the Venus of Willem Dorf and uh, I liked very much how uh, it was uh, a statue that showed you like a mother earth she was uh, heavy big breaths I guess uh, in the, and that is a stone age that's a stone age uh, picture um, a statue that shows that shows uh, a woman that gives uh, a lot of milk then also I guess sexually and and very few people at that time maybe in the stone age were uh, were heavy so most of them are thin because they had to look for their own food every day then uh, I was I painted uh, different forms of uh, a good good uh, the taste of the the modern time like a like a uh, I mean the Greek statues or Roman statues or statues from India you would see that they are all very uh, very healthy looking later on uh, I started to sort of make like uh, women with long long forms and they were long-legged and uh, then I was thinking these women that are supposed to be ideal is their form is full of muscles they hardly have breath they are all muscles uh, quite strong and uh, as you could see in the olympics the women are uh, really very slim and strong with muscles but then uh, there is a form that i like with women with a uh, bigger behind nicer form or something like this so most of the nudes that i was making was was uh, the the women are all mostly uh, turning their back anyway uh, as I see in time, people change what they like uh, of forms. Now I'm, I'm attracted to uh, something like abstract, abstract type of, of uh, painting, how, how to interpret the form of a woman, but it seems like I'm being taken back to the forms that I like. I have to, I want to see them, uh, I want to see their forms still and give it an, a little bit of an abstract look. That's how I paint now.